Club Express website options. Club Express includes a website with members-only and optional public-facing areas. There are many ways of customizing your website, including control over its look and feel, menus, and other features, and these are outlined in companion videos. This video focuses on the Website Options screen that presents choices to modify some website configuration settings. We're already logged into one of our demo sites as an administrator. To get to the configuration screen, go to the Control Panel's Website tab, then scroll to the bottom and click on Website Options. Let's look at the settings available on this screen. By default, Club Express places a link on the public side of the website which allows visitors, who are not logged in as members, to be added to your mailing list, and this is the non-member database. If you prefer, this link can be hidden by selecting No for the Show Add Me to Your Mailing List option. Note that some clubs turn off the built-in Add Me to Your Mailing List link and put in a customized link somewhere else on their website. To do this, use this HTML code format, where num is your club's internal ID, and that can be found on many of the URLs. And text is the text that you want to display as part of the link. When non-members ask to be added to your mailing list, they specify how they heard about your club or association. Setting the How Did You Hear About Us option to Yes also adds this feature to the opening screen of the new member signup wizard. The select list is customized by going to the Control Panel's non-member database screen, clicking the How Heard button, and adding or modifying the items to display to the user. For the Show My Directory Listing link, select Yes to display a special link in the Login panel once members have logged in. This link jumps to the member's bio page so they can review and edit it. You can also specify the text that's to be used for this link. By default, trial members can log into the website and are treated as regular members. The trial members can access the website option allows you to block trial members from logging into your website. Club Express also includes a benefits module. This is typically placed on the public side of your website to extol the benefits of joining your organization. When the show member sign up link in benefits option is set to yes, a button appears in this module allowing non-members to jump straight to the membership sign-up wizard. You can also control the text to use for this link. The default is Sign Me Up. Some clubs and associations have a separate public website and use Club Express only as their members and admin website. When the member or admin logs out of your Club Express website, you might want to redirect them immediately to your public site. In this case, enter the URL of the other website in the redirect to a different site on logout field. If you leave it blank, members will be taken to the home page of your current website when they log out. When the membership directory module is enabled, the system usually places a vCard icon on the member's bio page, allowing other members to download contact information to their local personal information manager, also called a PIM, for example, Outlook. When the events calendar module is enabled, the system usually places a vCalendar icon on the Events Detail page, allowing members and non-members alike to download the event to their local PIM. With the vCard and vCalendar visibility options, you can control visibility for the vCard and vCalendar icons, showing them to everyone, or only to admins, or turning them off completely. The next section is about search engine optimization. Any keywords that you specify in the Website Keywords field will be placed in the Keywords Meta tag in the head tag of all the public web pages. Though most modern search engines now ignore keywords, some search engines use this metadata tab to help them index your pages. Specifying the right keywords can improve your relative position in organic search results generated by these engines. If you've signed up with Google Site Verification, enter the unique ID for your website provided by Google into this box. Do not copy and paste the entire meta tag that Google specifies. We'll add that for you. If you've signed up for a Google Analytics account, enter your account number into the field provided. Do not enter the complete string provided by Google. 
just the unique number shown within the double quotes near the end of the string. This is usually in this format. Note that Google Analytics needs to be properly configured to work with Club Express. For more information, see the Club Express Administrator's Manual. Note that only traffic to public and member screens will be recorded. The system does not report visits to admin pages to Google. Note also that Google does not report analytics data in real time. There's a 24-hour delay. Once you configure Google Analytics in your Club Express website, you'll need to wait until the next day before you'll start to see the traffic data. Through Google Analytics, Club Express also has the ability to track outbound links on the website. Those are links that go to external websites. There's no user interface for this feature, so please notify Club Express support if you want to activate it. Click Save to save the screen and return to the control panel, or Cancel to return without saving. So now you've seen how the choices made on the website options page can affect some of your website's features. Thanks for watching, and we'll see you in the next video.